February 3rd, the source of our anxiety. When I see an anxious person, I ask myself, what do they want? For if a person wasn't wanting something outside of their own control, why would they be stricken by anxiety? Repetitus. The anxious father worries about his children. What does he want? A world that is always safe. A frenzied travel. What does she want? For the weather to hold and for the traffic to part so she can make her flight. A nervous investor that the market will turn around and an investment will pay off. All of those scenarios hold the same thing in common. As Epictetus says, it's wanting something outside our control. Getting worked up, getting excited, nervously pacing. These intense, pained and anxious moments show us at our most future and severe. Staring at the clock, at the ticker, at the next checkout lane over. At the sky, it's as if we all belong to a religious cult that believes the gods of fate will only give us what we want if we sacrifice our peace of mind. Today, when you find yourself getting anxious, ask yourself, why are my insides twisted into knots? Am I in control here or is my anxiety? And most important, is my anxiety doing me any good? Thank you for tuning in to today's episode of I'm Max with your host, Max Roeck. If you found value in our journey together, don't forget to subscribe so you never miss an upcoming episode. Love what you heard? Take a moment to capture a screenshot and share it on your social media platforms. Don't forget to tag Max. He's excited to share in your experience and offer his gratitude in return. For those eager to dive deeper, discuss today's topic, or if you're interested in being a guest on the show, please check out the show notes for all the ways to connect directly with Max. Max appreciates your choosing to spend your valuable time with him. As you go about your day, remember this empowering thought. You are your own hero. Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep growing.